of all the moments that you're living, how are you living? An athlete brought this up to me this week, and I, I thought it was fantastic. We had to stop everything and, and discuss this point. Of all the moments that you're living, how are you living? It suggests that we're unintentional or unaware a lot of the time. How often are you just doing things automatically? In fact, research shows that about 50% of our thoughts are just automatic and just pop into our head, unintentional, by accident. So half of what we're focusing on, we're not really deciding with intention or purpose. And what's that gonna do for our performance? How's that gonna help us achieve our goals if we're just going with the flow and things are happening by accident? It's very challenging, it's very difficult. It requires mental toughness and discipline to be able to put our attention onto important things and then act on it. Because here's the thing, everything you say and don't say counts. Everything you do or don't do counts. We're, we've got a brain that's constantly learning and, and a life that's constantly moving forward. And whether we're doing it intentionally or not, you know, if our goal is over here, we've got to be intentional about keeping our actions and our thoughts and our emotions in a direction that's going to go this way. But if they're just going kind of random all over the place and being unintentional, we may never get to our goal. And when we start to move away from here, we have to be intentional to bring it back and course correct so that we can get to where we want to go. Of all the moments that you're living, how are you living? Are you doing it with purpose? Are you taking stock of every decision and is it for an immediate gratification or will I postpone that for a greater achievement or goal later on? Hey, because here's another thing. We're going to suffer one way or the other. That the pain we can either take it now in service of the goal later on, or we can take the pleasure and enjoyment now and suffer the pain later on of the consequences. Like just take eating sweets, right? They taste good. You can forego that for health in the long term, and you can have the pain now for long-term health later, or you can eat all the sweets that you want and have the pain of cavities or obesity or whatever else later on. It's up to you. Pain's coming one way or the other. I encourage you to be more intentional and ask yourself this question. Of all the moments that you're living, how are you living? How are you spending your moments? Keep your values and your goals in mind and recognize that everything you say and do and everything you don't say and do matters. Be intentional with your choices. It's Dr. Eddie O'Connor, Mental Toughness is 60 Seconds.